Hello, spear slaying tubers, and welcome back to Let's Play the Story of Blue Cloud with me, Blue Ankylo. And uh, we are rocking it in uh, the new after post 1.2 version. So some of the map is a little bit weird looking compared to what it should be, but it seems to work. Now, for today's episode, the main thing will be upgrading the Godly Dragoon Lance to being a Godly Dragoon Lance number two. Uh, I just farmed some Dark Souls off camera and I noticed the Shaman Elver arrived. So I'm supposed to talk to this guy, supposedly. Um, I have no idea what he's talking about. Something about the Takers dominating the world. I've heard that before, probably when I first met him. Um, but apparently this is the guy that gives me a hint on what to do next, and I have no idea. Maybe I'm talking to the wrong Shaman. I don't know. Um, sure. It doesn't seem to tell me anything useful, though. Um, yeah. Okay. Okay. So, maybe he sells something now. I don't know. Oh, here you go! Um, <laughs> Witch King Scroll. To close the portal of the abyss, you must seek out the Witch King and restore the strange and restore the strange rings. So I think I thought the abyss meant like yeah, because we're in like dark sun mode. He will appear out of the abyss at night and more often deeper underground. So I've killed the Witch King many times. He just showed up on my house the first night. So that gave me the ring that let me switch to full on Blood Moon slash Abyss Knight. Yeah, Covenant of Artorius Ring. So that's how I got there, I guess. Anyway, I've killed the Witch King many times. And then Abyss Scroll. To close the seal of the Abyss and ignite the kiln of the first flame, you must defeat the six lords of the Abyss. Artorius, Blight, the Wyvern Maid Shadow. Chaos, the Seath of Scaleless. And the Seath of Scaleless. With a lord soul from each of these beings, you will be able to summon the final guardian, Gwyn, Lord of Cinder. To craft the summoning item for each guardian, you will need to return to eight familiar places and collect a unique item dropped from an enemy you will find there. So I assume this is basically... Yeah, to get, like, soul, uh, fires of the... or yeah, flames of the abyss, um different versions of Titanite and all that stuff and then that lets me craft it. So I was on the right track. I just never looked at that kind of like I was supposed to. Um, also, I think there's another... I want to have one of these rings. So where's my money? I'm going to pick up some money and I'm going to buy another silver ring because there's another... Well, no. I've got the uh, wolf ring now. That's right. I want the grey wolf ring. That gives me immunity to fire, bleeding, and broken armor. Which is pretty good. And I could, I could almost get that. I don't have any humanity with me. Anyway, that's um, that's all nice. So this Covenant of Artorius that I got way early and just foolishly put on, well, now I know what it does. Um, so what I'm, what am I doing? What am I thinking? Boss summoning items. I do know kind of how to make a couple. I was looking at that before. But anyway, what we really want, the reason you all tuned in here isn't to have me talk to the Shaman Elder for three minutes. It's to come down here and craft me up a new spear. This is the spear we've been waiting for. Probably the best melee weapon in the game. I'm gonna take a just just gonna take a guess and say this is probably the best melee weapon. It could be there's something better, but um, 650. Oh, I just got a lousy version. Dull. Ah, that's it. It's even faster than my old trident. Um, insane knockback as well, which is handy. All powerful spear. Awesome. So what I do need to do, of course, is upgrade it. And of course, my little buddy is gone because he died and I don't know where he went. I actually don't have that much money. What if I should sell some diamonds? <laughs> Anything you can do with diamonds? Nothing really that special. Strength potion. See, this is the kind of stuff I should have been making, I think. Things like strength, strength potions. Because I don't really know what they do. I, I assume they give you good stats, anyway. Uh, let's just put those diamonds away for now. So, I don't know how much this is going to cost. It's it's like legendary, epic tier, whatever you call it. And I don't have my little buddy again, because I don't know where he is. Oh, he's here. Okay, we can... Uh... There we go. He'll move in there. So he'll be here eventually. Um... Yeah, so now I've got my spear. I want to try it out. It's actually, yeah, 100 damage more than my Murderous Longinus, and that's with minus 15% damage. This thing should crest around somewhere near 1,000 melee damage, if I put all my buffs on it properly. 
I don't know why I've got all this gold junk to put it away. Um, because I've got my double damage. I think that's just double base damage. I've got 25% melee damage. I could also go with melee speed, but this is already very fast. So, putting on something like where is it? Sure, I had one somewhere around here. Um, oh, there's spare covenant, just what I need. Um. One of these chests has there. I could put this on. 12% more melee speed instead of invincibility time. I don't know. I don't know if that will make it fast enough. Like, it's already so fast. I don't think that will really make much difference. I don't know. Can you guys see the difference? I can't. So I'm not going to worry about that item. Um. Oh, Witch King bug. I should go put these somewhere. I, need to, I do need to fight the Witch King, like, a couple more times. Maybe that's what we'll do for a little while. We'll just kill the Witch King till we have the full set of armor from him. He should die really easily now. Um, yeah, let's just put it here. Why not? I just need his chest. So I need, uh... What was the Witch King summoning item? One of the rings. I hope I saved one. I didn't just throw them all out. Uh... That summons Artorius. Mind Flayer King at trees. Maybe there is no. Is there no. No, there had to be. The broken ring that I fixed. Or did he drop the broken ring? Maybe that's it. He dropped the broken ring and then I forged that into the strange magic ring. Yeah, that's probably what happened. I'm just thinking I could summon him. Anyway, um, for continuation purposes, what are we going to do? I need to figure out the next um, boss. I don't know which the next one is to fight. I've got... Oh, also, I forgot to mention. I got uh, a few dark Guardian Souls. Death kept spawning overnight, so I've got lots of those now. Um, got lots of Souls of Atreides. I think I'm good for weapons. I want this shield. Um, I want the... Uh, what's it called? I want the... Um, Basilisk shield or Medusa shield, whatever it's called. Uh, I don't have enough of those. I don't have any Red Titanite. I definitely don't have... Topaz for Dying Wind Crystal or Dying Wind Shards. Oh, wait, hold on. I gotta kill this guy quick. Oops. This is really not the time to be, uh, to be bothering me there. <laughs> That's how we deal with those guys. Easy. I like Fire Soul Potions. A little bit 10% extra damage. That's not bad. I can get his pants. I don't think... Did I ever actually make his armor? I, I don't know if I've ever got that before. Random drops, guys. Random drops. Um, magic mirror. I do have that. I have white titanite. I don't have enough flames of the abyss, though. So I have to go fight something to get those. Blight stone. Well, I have a stone. I don't have enough humanity. I've got lots of cursed souls. So I need, like, red titanite and flames of the abyss. So what do you guys think? Like, it said every different area. So I've spent some time in the corruption getting a couple things. Let's, uh... I don't know. What did he say? He, he said the different areas, I think. Um, eight familiar places. Corruption, jungle, dungeon. I never went to the jungle. This, oh, the jungle had the demon in it. Well, hey, let's just go for a run. Why not? Oh, also one thing. Sorry. I have all my money with me. I don't want to lose it. I should stack it away. I do want to buy um, upgrades for my spear because it will be really good once I've got something better than dull. <laughs> I probably have lost a lot of money over the game by throwing stuff away and uh, just generally not being smart with my cash. Now, if I'm looking for... Oops, I keep switching to that item. If I'm looking for these special items, the uh, cursed soul flame type things, I wonder if that's when you're actually supposed to be in abyss mode. Like, can I even get those enemies to spawn in this mode, actually. that's that's. I'm not 100% sure. Like, it may be what I was having a hard time there. You're supposed to have a hard time. <laughs> and that's just the way it's supposed to work. I'm thinking of going to the jungle. So, um, I'm heading a little bit further over to get to the normal underground jungle. We did the underground corruption a little bit, and the new enemies there were the bats that gave me the flames and the corruptors that gave me uh, cursed souls, I think. Oh look, my nurse moved there this time. That's great. Exactly where we don't want her to live. I'm having a hard time keeping my NPCs alive, definitely, since uh, since we switched. All right, so we're gonna go down this path here and maybe buff up so I can see a little bit better. And we're just gonna keep going down and see if we can find um, 
yeah, these things. Like, that's uh, a different kind of dark knight, a blood knight. So I think there's quite a few different of uh, different. Well, that one got me some flames. See, I need lots of flames in the abyss, so that's good. Um, I think there's a different dark knight, kind of like for all the different areas. It's, 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 um, how do you get down to the? Uh, well, we'll just explore it again. It's been a while. Um, and the hornets there. Hornets are good because those guys drop flames of the abyss too. So maybe that means the jungle is where you're supposed to go to get flames of the abyss. That seems legitimate. That seems legit. I love the AI for Dark Knights. They're so stupid. <laughs> um, what was I saying? I don't know. Seems like jungle for flames of the abyss. I don't know what the other areas are necessarily. I will fight the uh, fiends eventually again. The um, I'm actually going the right way. This is good. Hey, that's an assassin. Have we have we killed an assassin before? Well, we have now. Um, didn't look like he dropped anything I needed. I think. Do you guys see anything that I needed? Oh, I shouldn't be. Uh, gotta be careful. I don't lose those. I don't want to fight a trades again. What the heck is that? Hold on, hold on. He disappeared. Okay, well, he turns invisible, apparently. Whatever that thing is. Okay. Abyss Walker. 20,000 HP. That's a lot. This thing might actually kill me if I'm not really careful. Oops. <laughs> that was a good job, Blue. That was a good job. Alright. So, he does a lot of damage. He teleports. I just did 1,400 damage, though. That's... If I was not so close to death, I wouldn't be... Oh, come on! He jumped out of nowhere! Uh, I'm dead. There's no way. 39 seconds on a heal. Maybe he'll just jump in the lava and die like a fool. Nope! He'll teleport right behind me and kill me in one shot. <laughs> Alright, well, even when you're not on uh, Abyss Mode, Permanent Blood Moon, uh, the enemies are still quite tough. Like, that's... I think that's the problem, is I was... Uh, I jumped to wearing this thing too quickly. I should have, uh, I should have done it like this normally. But I, in my defense, it's not very good at explaining it. It doesn't say it forces you into the abyss. Like, I thought, I kind of thought it just let you, I don't know, it was just miscommunication. I thought it did something different than what it actually did. I was thinking, like, the abyss was going to be another area or something. Or like another, I don't know, something. I don't know what I was thinking. Let's just be honest here, I, I messed up. Was there piles of gold in there before? <laughs> My map is a little bit messed up now, I'll be honest. Oh, another one of these things. Okay, you gotta die, buddy. Your brother killed me last time. You gotta die. Part of the problem is I can't see him, but there we go. Okay, six flames of the abyss. Awesome. Okay, I'm uh, taking a lot more damage than I was expecting. Okay, so it seems definitely abyss worthy here. Good. So what other areas could we go to to get um, items? The like they they said the ocean, I think. Oh, here we are. We're getting close to corruption with these guys. These guys are a bit of a pain. They have a lot of life. Thirty thousand. And it's pretty hard to dodge all their attacks. Yep. I'm just... See, that's the thing. Like, if I'm on Blood Moon Moon, then you fight, like, five of those at a time. And I just can't handle that. <laughs> I'm probably going to have to spend a bunch of time grinding for this stuff off camera. I, I use the word grinding in the worst possible way. Because I am going to be just doing what I just did there, basically. Fighting and dying and fighting and dying and fighting and dying until I hopefully... Uh, until I hopefully uh, win, basically. Oops. Well, not even win, just until I hopefully have enough. Uh, enough of the various crafting things. So, I suppose I'll put a, a cut in the video. Um, what I'm thinking of trying to craft then is whatever needed the Flames of the Abyss, because I'm getting quite a few from the jungle. So I figure we'll go for that boss fight first, because uh, seems fair. See if I can get my souls again. There we go. I mean, it's nice to have lots of souls. So this will lead... This is actually where I was meaning to go. This is like the underground um, Forgotten City. 
I was thinking there'd be lots of room around here to fight new enemies. But uh, then I died. So we get some new, some more new tiles here too. Very nice. Oh good, baths of the things. I hit those. Well, actually, that was an easy one. <laughs> they do come much more difficult than that. Have I ever been in that on the right? I probably did. Yeah. I was just thinking it was kind of dark. Assassin, right? You like to teleport. Cheaters. Cheating, teleporting losers. So glad I got this spear though. Yeah, he doesn't seem to drop anything besides a couple weird things like that. A couple weird potions. Alright, so I'm going to put a break in the video for a little bit, and I'm going to try to load up on um, Flames of the Abyss. Here, I'll even show you what I'm trying to make. I am trying to make... Not the Dragoon Armor yet. Oh, that's going to be awesome once we get that stuff. It's going to be so good. Um, I haven't even looked at the buffs that they give you, but look at that. That gives me full health when you respawn. That's awesome. Um, wait, tight. Yeah, I could make the dark mirror probably, uh, possibly right now. Actually, do I actually have enough stuff for that? Let's just have a quick look. Because this is, I wanted to fight a new boss to for today's episode, so that's kind of what I was thinking here. Uh, no, I need two more of those. I got lots of white titanite. So uh, yeah, I'll meet you guys back once I've got a few more flames. Basically, I just need like two more. So see you in a bit. And here we are, folks. It actually didn't take very long to get my extra couple of souls. They, they come really quickly in that jungle. So definitely, Flames of the Abyss, go to the jungle. That's what I've learned so far. White Titanite, just stand around your house. The rest of the stuff, we'll figure it out as we go. I also decided, uh, well, he's here now anyway. I want to spend my money trying to upgrade this spirit. Anything's better than minus 15% damage. I get one try. Damn! <laughs> Okay, well, there's one thing I can do. <laughs> that, that is ridiculous. Anything is better. You just had to do that to me, didn't you? You just had to. Um, just go down a little bit. Just uh, looking for nothing in particular. You know, nothing, nothing in particular. Oh, what's that? Suddenly Blue has a bunch of money? Where did all that money come from? Stupid game. Mmm, I don't want low speed. No. Nope. 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 I don't care if I get the best one, I just want something kind of okay. I'll take it. <laughs> anyway, I'll throw the rest of my coins away. So yeah, I cheated, blah blah blah, sorry. I don't feel like grinding for money. I throw away money. It does a bit more damage than it used to. <laughs> I'm sorry everyone. I just, I'm at the point where I don't have patience for stuff. I'll grind for um, secret materials, but I'm not going to grind for freaking money. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll still get my own Dark Souls, and I'll still get my own uh, crafting ingredients for now, but uh, <laughs> um, I forgot the mirror. Of course, I forgot something. I have all the other bits except the one I needed. And I saved a bit. Good. So I've got Flames of the Abyss, Titanite, a few Dark Souls, a Soul of Atreides, right? I still have those with me. Good. In fact, I'm going to put most of them away just so I stop. I've been just dragging these around for way too long. All right, there we go. So that's what I wanted. Hopefully I'm not supposed to be fighting these bosses in the Abyss mode. I don't really understand. Like, I don't know why you'd ever actually have to go to the Abyss so far other than just kind of to have like a, uh, if you wanted a Blood Moon or you wanted uh, like Battle Potion effect where you get more items, more enemies. Did I? Why? Why? No, there it is. There it is. Sorry, no, no worries, no worries. Not the great magic mirror, not the village mirror. The dark mirror. You look into the mirror and see your reflection looking back at you. As you continue to gaze into the mirror, the background behind your reflection becomes murky, as if peering into a dark abyss. See, I thought this would take me to the abyss, honestly. Use the mirror at night to unlock and to continue looking in the eyes of your reflection. Okay. We will try that, whatever the boss is. Um, I still think... I don't know. Where, where's a good place to fight these bosses? I like, I can't really build an arena, but I don't want to fight them in town where my friends will be killed. I have a hard enough time keeping the NPCs alive as it is. Um, you know, it's pretty wide open over here. We could do it at the bridge. Just, this place isn't too bad, I guess. Alright, buff up. And I'm going to use some fire soul potions. Because I got them. Seems like you have to take those ones manually. Not every potion works with the buff button. 
Um, I, uh, I don't really care about souls for a boss fight so much, so we'll go with faster healing. And longer invincibility is really good, double damage is really good, and 25% damage is pretty good. I could go with some more defense. I don't think going to the abyss mode is worth that though. <laughs> Immunity to on fire and that is nice, but I do have a Suna which seems to work. Anyway, let's give it a try. And it is just starting night, I think. Well, let's double check. Let's make sure it's the very beginning of night. Night starts. There you go. Perfect. All right, let's do it. Well, Dark Cloud. That's that's cool. That's from like multiple different games. Anyway, um, we're ready. Everybody's ready to go. Let's do it. Are you gonna head out in the water? Why are you in the water? There's just that teeny little bit of water and he jumped right in it. Dark Cloud, you're not very smart. Come on. There you are. I knew you could teleport. Of course you teleport. Alright, he does a lot of damage. I'm assuming he could be harder than Artorias. I'm not sure. Okay, he likes to teleport right on top of me. I hate bosses that teleport right on top of me. Haven't you learned yet? I don't like those kind of fights. How much does he have? 96,000. So he's a bit tougher than Artorius, it's true. Luckily, I have Artorius's ring and an amazing spear. I could... I probably would be smarter to have gone for the Dragoon Armor level 2 before fighting these bosses. Well, that was just cheap! Tele well, we're dead. <laughs> What's that? Crippled! Mobility down! Can't... I can't fly! Now I can fly. Woo! That was scary. Well, I'm still gonna die. <laughs> I suppose I should really look up what I need to make to get my, um, to get the Dragoon upgraded armor, because I think I might, I think it'll make this stuff a lot easier. Come on, teleport. Teleport, you stinker. Also, I can rebuff. Seeing as he likes to break my buffs. Okay. You're way too dashy. This is like the most dashy of them all. Wow, I'm I'm toast. Why is that giant spear flying around? <laughs> what is going on with this boss? Ah, oh, guys. Yeah, look at this. Spears flying everywhere. I only got lucky just not to get killed there. Is this a... Barrel White Nemesis. 13,000. Of course there's a sub-boss. What if I can kill it really quick? Kill, kill, kill. Got it. Well, I may be dead now, but at least I killed the Barrel White Nemesis. So how are you supposed to deal with this jumpy business? Always teleporting behind me, like... It's a good thing I got a Suna. Oh, no, no, no! No, no, no! Don't go down there, Blue! I can't fly! I can't fly. I hate it when you can't fly. <laughs> not being able to fly is cheating. <laughs> so it's either confused or not being able to fly. Well, it's good. It's great. All right, well, at least we can summon that boss now. <laughs> I don't know guys, what do you think? Uh, should I get better armor before I go too crazy with the bosses maybe? It's gonna take a while sort of off camera. I should have put a teleporter over there, I forgot. Uh, I'm not gonna fight him again right now. That's That wasn't close enough for me to think I'm gonna win if I fight him again right away. Um, I don't know, I, I, I could probably make better armor. That's not the right souls. There we go. So, um, that's Dark Cloud Summoner. What? I don't know how to get a Dragoon Cloak. That's the main thing. I got a bit of humanity. I've got a few Dragoon Scales, or Dragon Scales. Um, but so far it's that Star Cloak thing, or whatever, Dragoon Cloak. Dying Wind Shard, I don't know how to get those yet either. And, what's the last piece? That's basically it. So, I don't know. I guess we just need to figure out where to get all these items. Maybe that's what I'll do today. We'll say, um, I know where to get Flames of the Abyss now, which lets me craft um, the Dark Cloud boss. I'm not really sure we're ready to fight him 100%. He's very, very small and very, very jumpy, which is bad for melee. Um, I'm also kind of curious about figuring out that, uh, what am I saying? 
the shield, because it seems like maybe as a melee class I should have a shield, and I'm just being dumb. Anyway, um, Corruption gives you Cursed Souls, Jungle gives you Cursed Flames, so we're at two out of all of the various ingredients. Speaking of Cursed Flames, this guy should give me one. There we go. Flames of the Abyss, whatever you call them. Um, what I need to find, I've got White Titan, so I've got three of the uh, special ingredients, basically, and I don't know how to get... Uh, the other colors of Titanite, basically. That's like, the I need to find Underground Hallow. Where is the Underground Hallow, anyway? Do you guys remember? I honestly don't really remember Underground Hallow that well. I guess um, oh, these guys, boss fight. Um, this is a uh, Slogger and Gaibon or whatever. Remember them? I only ever fought them like one time. Hope I didn't just kill them like that. Slogra, my old pal. But you don't like my new spear very much, do you? Well, he, maybe he's a harder version of the old Slogra, because he seems to do a lot of damage. Oh, he's going to kill me! Why does everything kill me? Come on, guys. It's not fair for everything to kill poor Blue. Have I almost got him? Two more hits, maybe. Come on, just get a little bit lucky here. Come on, what's that teleporting business? What the heck is that? Tetsu Jujin? Tetsu something or rather? I have no idea. What is it? Is this gonna stand there? Some kind of floating alien thing, I guess. I guess there's lots of little hidden mini bosses. I don't really have a lot of life right now to play with, so I'm like. Whoa! What? 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 Don't stand still. Okay, I get it. I must have had barred arrows at the beginning by accident, and I used those on him, because I did a lot of damage the first couple arrows. <laughs> Alright, well, it's going to be the spear. Come on. Yeah, the spear just does so much more damage. Almost got him. Alright, another boss down, or whatever that is. I don't know. Uh, destruction element for some pretty epic <laughs> 4,500 damage? I guess I'm gonna have to make that. All I need is some humanity. I think the humanity will be from uh, uh, the underworld, the hell area. I think. From those demons and stuff. Anyway, what was I trying to do? I was trying to get over to like the water area, the ocean. I know it may not look like I was trying to get to the ocean, but that is actually where I was going. Or, um, I suppose... Meteorite? Is this... No, this whole dungeon isn't all meteorite. I never did go back down here after I got my, uh... My Dragoon armor that lets me go through through lava. I mean, I'm just kind of curious if there's any new monsters right now. I'm looking for new creatures to fight. Now that we're kind of doing good again... And I say that with a large kind of... So... Hmm. Armored Wraith, that didn't give me anything. Uh, I think if I go to the right also, I will. Ev if I go down and right, I'll eventually hit up the water area. Oh look, a shadow chest I never opened. I don't actually have my key with me. Whatever. I think this might be a part of the dungeon I didn't go to because it took. I took a different entrance, maybe? Uh, no, I probably went through this before. I must have just missed that shadow chest once I got the key. There's a shadow chest there if you guys want to go get it. I doubt it. it could, it's not going to have anything useful anymore now. Yeah, I must have gone through all this before. Slogger and Gaibon again. Well, if you're going to be dumb, just stand over there. What is that down there? Okay, that's the easy basilisk. There's two kinds of basilisk, and some are very bad. Uh... Anyway, we got him. Another Flame of the Abyss, no big deal. Alright, I am looking- I think this was the way over. Good. I think- I think I had to mine that out earlier. Cause- Okay, Underground Hallow- Oh yeah, the Hallow Caves! That's what everyone was telling me when I was saying that. Okay. I'm hoping I get something in here that, uh... Some new item that I'm looking for. I completely forgot about these Hallowed Caves. Wow. That's- that's really bad. How did I forget about this place? Okay, we got Crystal Knights. Oh yeah, these guys suck. They like 
freeze you so you can't move. Not very nice. Blue Titanite. So that's what we get. Good. That's uh, Assassin? Necromancer? I don't know. 25,000 HP. That's a lot. He didn't give me anything good. Anyway, we've got Crystal Knight for, um, for Blue Titanite, which is good. Because I wasn't sure how to get that stuff yet. So that covers maybe almost everything now. I, I think I need to get to the ocean eventually, though. There's got to be a couple more. I think there's red titan. I don't have any of that yet, either. Dead end. Yeah, I do remember this place a little bit. Not that it's all that hard anymore with all of our super spear. So I'm not getting a lot of crystal knights. There's got to be some other enemies down here that give me a blue titan knight. Come on, game. There's got to be more than just that one guy. Because so far, mostly I'm just getting normal, you know, hallowed stuff. Oh, right. This is where we fought the, uh, the rage, I believe. Why not? This will count as hell, so we'll see what's down here. Hell Underworld, whatever you guys want to call it. Why is this guy so tough? Oh, Serpent of the Abyss, 60,000 HP. I wonder if that guy drops Cursed Souls or something. Or, uh... Whatever it is I'm thinking of. There's something that we got from that Abyssal Demon, that one I fought in the jungle area before. I can't remember what it was I got. Unfortunately, you've got a really dumb AI, my friend. Oh, I'm, I'm muted. I can't, actually. <laughs> I just want to make sure he dies above. I keep getting muted. That's, that's not very nice. I can't even use Asuna when I'm muted. Slowed life regen. That sucks. Anyway, there we go. What did I get? Humanity. Right. So, yeah. Humanity definitely comes from down in the hell area. And this is just a teeny weeny little bit of hell area, but... Uh, what's this? What's that? What was that? Get back here, you. Oh, this is just a cursed demon. No big deal. We know those things. So, I don't know. Is this a good area? It's kind of small. I suppose if I had like a battle potion, or even worse, put it on abyss mode, then uh, I could probably get more to spawn quicker. This isn't really where I was planning on going. Attraction potion, does that do what I think it does? Did I pick it up? Did I just throw it on the ground? Fire soul, crimson. Doo -doo -doo. I'm pretty sure I picked up a different, there we go. Initiate a blood moon, huh. Well, you know, if I wanted to... What am I thinking about? If I want to fight more of these guys, all I have to do is equip this. And, uh, we'll get crazy amounts of bad stuff, I think. Yeah, yeah. See, listening! This is this is what I was worried about. <laughs> um, we'll see if I can kill him. Come on. There's not a whole lot of room to dodge right now. Halfway dead. Halfway dead. Okay. Well, they die quickly. That's good. Whew. Got some more humanity. Only one, though. I actually got more from the snake thing. The, uh, whatever you call it. It's giant serpent. Abyssal serpent. Seems like a fair idea. Okay, what's this? Hydrus elementals and ne necromancer. All right. So he summons those guys. No big deal. You are dead, my friend. Oh, wait a second. Is that... That's a dying wind shard. That's another one I needed. I wonder if I missed some before because I had inventory problems. Uh, I don't think I've got enough life left in me to kill it this time, though. Fortunately. I, uh, I'm a little bit low on the old health. Come on. This is not going to do enough damage to be useful. So yeah, I don't know what kind of magic will compete with this spear, but... <laughs> it's going to take some pretty good, powerful magic to match up with this kind of weapon. I gotta say, guys. I mean, you see how much damage this thing does. Well, he almost got me. Got a little bit more... I got one humanity. Really, that's... Seems like a bad deal only getting one at a time. You should be able to get more than one at a time. 
Day Bloom, Gel. At least I got one blue. I need I need regular blue Titanite. I need lots of that stuff for my uh, armor set, I think. Another one. Wow. They sure like to summon those things. Okay, what if I got Ice Force? I don't see this doing nearly enough damage, though. That's the problem. Like, even though magic's good. I mean, I don't really have magic. Well, I mean, okay. Don't get me wrong. It's not that I don't have a magic set. This double damage, I think, doubles the magic damage, too. And the uh, stat bonus from the Dragoon armor should apply. Well, there's no stat bonus. Yeah, 30% to all stats. That should apply to magic damage and magic crit just as well. The only thing that's not for magic is this, and I could have, um... Well, I need to figure out what... There's that artifact that gives you, um... Cheaper, uh... Magic mana cost? That might be what I need to get, is, uh... Like, one MP for MP. Because then I could really spam spells like crazy. Just the way I spam my spear. Oh, I got... Is a spirit thing got me. Can't swing my spear spear. Okay, well, I'm not a huge fan of these Abyssal guys, gotta say. Not a huge fan, all in all. Okay, well, I got a couple of humanity. I'm really not... I'm not happy with how long that's gonna take. Like, one at a time fighting those guys seems like a really bad idea. But, uh, anyway, there you go. Has my episode been this long already? Well, I guess I'll leave you in the hallowed caves. I uh, I might spend a bit of time off camera trying to gather up more ingredients. Um, I still don't know how to get everything. Um, and this hallowed cave is not the best for... If this is where I'm supposed to get blue titanite, then I need a lot more. Oh, a warlock! Remember back when you guys were scary? <laughs> Actually, this might lead me right to the water area. This is what I was trying to get to. All right, well, we'll kill you first. Let's do it. Yeah, those one blue titanite. That's that's tough. Still hallowed. I was thinking if I can get to the uh, the water area, I'll see what's in the ocean under under ocean bit. If I can get there. No, this is. Oh yeah, this is this is the right area, right? I think I am going the right way, right guys? <laughs> a little bit lost. It's been so long since I've been down here. I don't... Do I still have fast movement? I don't know if I get the movement speed underwater the same as the, uh, the blue armor did. So I wonder if this counts... Yeah, does this just count as hollow after all? I wasn't sure when I came down here the first time if this was something special. Ghost of the Dark Moon Knight. I don't think those guys drop anything. No. Didn't look like it. Well, I mean, uh, I've made some progress. I'd like, to I'd like to think that finally, in super hard mode, I'm starting to make a little bit of progress. Like, I'm not doing great. The bosses are still really, really tough. But, um, yeah, this is where we got to the ocean from. Oh, you know what I should do? Yeah! Just to prove to you guys that I do remember. <laughs> Apparently there's a chest... <laughs> that I could have gotten way back. That's just out here somewhere. Um, I can't get out here. It's like over there to the right. And I just missed it the first time or something. <laughs> Let's go get that. Just because I had quite a few comments about that. On that video. That I missed uh, a chest in the ocean. <laughs> and now I am officially in the ocean. So maybe there'll be some new monsters. You never know. Oh, well, this still has the hollow music. I don't know. So where is it? Where did I miss? What did I miss? Right there. Wow, that is a sneaky one. That's very sneaky. So let's find out what I would have got if I'd come here all those days ago, back when you guys told me I missed this thing. <laughs> Why not? Why not? <laughs> uh, no, wrong chest. This chest. Don't need mushrooms. Oops. Of course, I actually have to use the right spell. Ah! Quit messing with me, game. I'll need to do some inventory sorting later. So I could have gotten uh, basically nothing. 
<laughs> Another shadow key. A shadow key inside a shadow, a locked shadow chest. That's just silly. So, uh, nothing really that good. So I don't feel too bad for missing that. Alright, anyway, we're in the ocean. I, I'm kind of curious if there's, like, normal ocean enemies that give me something. So I'm trying to get away from what's counted as hallow. So we're just gonna float around here for just a little bit and see if I can get, uh... I don't know, sharks? Where's the sharks at? That's what I want to see, like, something. Maybe there's no enemies here. The ocean seems kind of boring, guys. <laughs> Could be snow biomes have new enemies, I can't remember. Up there somewhere? Oh well, I suppose this episode's dragged on long enough. I'll probably... I'll probably do a little bit of exploring off camera. I'm not sure yet how much I want to do off camera just right now. Not finding a whole lot. Anyway, yeah, let's, let's just cut it here, that's fine. So, um, yeah, in the next couple episodes, my goal will be to figure out how to get all of the rare items. Humanity. What am I missing? What have I missed? Um, quick stack. So I've gotten... I can get more Souls of Artorias. I, I think I got the Dragon Scales from the, uh, the Hellkite thing, so I don't know how to get more of those yet. I've got lots of Cursed Souls. I've got lots of White Titanite. I'll need lots of humanity, and I'll need lots of flames of the abyss. That's one, two, three, four, five ingredients. I'm sure there's more. Oh, blue titanite, right? There. So that's six ingredients. I I'm assuming there's still some more, but uh, at least we're on the right track now. So anyway, thanks for watching, and I hope you have enjoyed. Have a great day, and I am just oh dying wind crystal. See, I got wind shards too. So there's so much little things like that I I got to gather up. There we go. So I got seven of the items. There you go. I saw it. I saw it. <laughs> All right, folks. See you later.